Simon says, subscribe and click on the bell icon to receive notifications. Hello everyone, welcome to a new tutorial from Simon Says It. In this video, I'll show you how to insert a hyperlink in Excel. Hyperlinks are an important part of any application that you can use to access or refer to other data with just a click. In Excel, you can do much more than just hyperlinking a web page to the text. You can embed other worksheets and workbooks, create a new workbook, and even create a hyperlink to an email. Additionally, these hyperlinks not only pertain to text. You can also add hyperlinks to charts and images. In this video, you'll learn how to insert a hyperlink in Excel in three easy ways. The first method is by using the Insert menu. This is the most common method to insert a link into an Excel cell, and it offers a variety of functionalities and options. To insert a hyperlink, first select a cell. You can select any empty cell or a cell that already has text in them. This text will act as an anchor text for the link. After selecting a cell where you want to insert the link, navigate to Insert. Under the Link section, click Link. This opens up a new dialog box. In the Insert Hyperlink dialog box, under the Link To section, you can see options to insert a hyperlink for either a web page, open a new workbook, add a link to an existing worksheet, or even a mail address. Select the option you want to insert the hyperlink to and enter the necessary details. In this case, let us hyperlink a web page. In the Address text box, enter the correct address of the web page. It is always better to practice to copy and paste the web address than to enter them manually. If you haven't added any anchor text, you can enter them in the Text to Display text box. Click OK. This inserts the web page link into the cell which contains the anchor text. When you click on the text, you'll be directed to the respective web page. Another way to insert a hyperlink is by using a formula. Using the hyperlink function, you can insert hyperlinks into cells in Excel. And the hyperlink function takes two arguments. To use the hyperlink function, select a destination cell. Enter the formula in the destination cell and press enter. In the same way, you can also insert a hyperlink to a file. Just enter the file location in the first argument and the anchor text in the second argument. This is an easy and simple way to insert a hyperlink in Excel. Just by dragging and dropping a cell, you can insert a hyperlink to a cell. First, select a cell and enter the anchor text. Move the mouse pointer to the corner of the cell. You can see the pointer turn to a four-sided movable pointer. Right-click and drag the cell to a new position or place it in the same position. Now, leave the mouse button and click on Create Hyperlink Here. This hyperlinks the anchor text with the current workbook as default. You can then copy and paste the hyperlink into a new worksheet or a new workbook. If you want to change the hyperlink, right click on the link and click on Edit Hyperlink. This in turn opens the Insert Hyperlink dialog box. Using this, you can change the embedded link or file based on your choice. To delete a hyperlink, right click on the link and click on Remove Hyperlink. That is all, everyone. We saw how to insert a hyperlink in Excel along with the options it offers. You can either use the Insert Main Menu and the Insert Hyperlink dialog box by using the formula or by dragging and dropping the cells. Thank you. If you're not a subscriber, click down below to subscribe so you get notified about similar videos we upload. To see the full course that this video came from, click over there. And click over there to see more videos from Simon Says It.